I think a lot of people stay in relationship when the shit is already over. So I wanted to make a video of signs that your girlfriend has checked out emotionally. She's done. Like she's done with you, but she's still in here for no reason. So you gotta kick her out. Actually, I can't say for no reason because maybe she's there for your money. Maybe she's there because she's lonely. She needs company, but she's wasting your time. So kick her out. So either she doesn't kiss you anymore or there is no more passion when she kisses you. It's just like a habit, like a little peg. It's not like it's going to turn to like a steamy makeout station. It's just like a habit. Like she don't really care. She doesn't bother spending time with you. You know how we are girls. We want to be under you and like hang out with you all the time. If she doesn't want to hang out or like even when you guys are at the house together, like she's on her phone and you're playing video games and there is no interaction, she's checked out. A lack of communication. If she doesn't talk to you anymore, if she doesn't share her feelings, you know, girls are like that. Most girls are sharing their feelings. If you don't hear about her complaining about anything, yeah. Ooh, that's a good one. If she doesn't fight you anymore. You know, you guys used to argue and have difference of opinions. Now she doesn't even care for your opinion. She's just like, it's whatever. Yeah, because she don't care about you no more. It's kind of like the relationship is not worth fighting. Yeah, it's, yeah, I'm here, but I'm not. If she keeps on going out with her friends, and some of her friends, you never met them, you already know those are new friends, or they're not even friends, they're like potential guys that she's interested in. That's why she's not introducing you to them, because that's your replacement. That's your replacement. That's your replacement. I'm not going to introduce you to your replacement, like, I think like I have a boyfriend no I don't have a boyfriend I'm already single but you just don't know about it also if she's the type that was like really used to introduce you to all her friends and then all of a sudden she doesn't introduce you yeah you know you know you know it's a wrap it's a wrap when you guys are out when she finally says yes to go out with you she checks out other guys like maybe she was doing it before because i know i'd be looking at dudes but just to see what's out there you know but um if she does it more than she used to it's like she's looking for your replacement she's no longer affectionate she doesn't touch you when she passed by you she doesn't try to kiss you she doesn't try to have sex with you like either she's already fucking somebody else or she's looking for it this one is a big sign if she doesn't want to engage with your family or your friends anymore when you know like she was always like yeah i'm gonna go see your sister and hang out with your mom and now there is none of that yeah <laughs> why go see your family when she's about to be done with you or while she's not feeling you she's not feeling your family either you know that that's usually how it works most girls are like attached to their phones i mean guys too but so now when you text her she takes forever to answer it's not like she don't see the text it's just like you're not a priority anymore so she's like yeah i'll answer when i have time or when i feel like it it's not about time it's when she feels like it so get the fuck out it's time to go she doesn't care about your day anymore when you come home she pretty much doesn't even say hi and she doesn't ask you how was your day what did you do what did you eat nothing yep she don't care she gets annoyed with you super easily like i remember i was in relationships and some stuff that used to not bother me all of the sudden was like oh my god this is so fucking annoying i used to laugh at them shits and now it's like Ugh, what the fuck like so yeah if she's always annoyed by something you do that you used to do and now it's a big deal she's done you're done when she goes out she behaves like she's single because she has to the door has to be left open for the other motherfucker that's gonna come in and replace you so you should leave before that Ooh, she doesn't talk about your future together like she doesn't talk about kids she doesn't talk about trips you know girls love going on trips she doesn't talk about none of that it's because she's either planning it with somebody else already or she's just looking for that and she's not trying to go on vacation with you no more no that's a waste of time so maybe you already felt like all the shit that was going on like it's not normal no more so you're like yo what's going on and she's like i don't want to talk about this like can we talk about it another day like i'm tired it's always a problem with you like it's always something why can't we just be cool yeah she don't want to talk about the relationship and the issues you already know she's out so this one i've done it before i said um i'm moving i'm moving to new york i'm moving to la 
while I have a boyfriend. So I'm not even asking you if you want to come or if it's cool for me to go. Like I'm just telling you, I'm going. So if I'm telling you I'm going, pretty much I don't care if you're coming or not. So yeah, I'm making a life decision without factoring you in it. Meaning you can stay here, I'll be out. And of course, if she starts talking about, you know, let's date other people. Let's have an open relationship. When you know them well, she didn't want to share you in the beginning. You might have been okay with an open relationship. And she was like, no, no, I can't do that. And now she's open to it all of a sudden. It's not like she feels like your relationship got to that level where you guys can go do it. It's just, she just want to do other people and she wants you to be okay with it so the thing for women it's like they can be emotionally checked out but they don't want to let you go really because it's like i don't want to be alone i want to have somebody else it's kind of like just the time for her to find somebody else so i'm here with you yeah it's cool or not really cool but i don't want to be alone and just in case i don't find anybody else i know i still have you pretty much i want you to stick around until i find somebody else and if I don't find anybody else, I'll stay with you. But I'm really settling because I don't really give a fuck at this point. It's like at the end of the day, we're all human. And some people are really scared of being alone. And or, or going into the unknown. You feel like you're done with that person, but you're still scared. You're like, what if I'm making a bad decision? What if I'm not going to find anybody new? What if uh, I regret it? People are like that. But... If you love somebody and you really want to be with them and you see all these signs or three or four or five of the signs, get the fuck out of there, okay? Because you're wasting your time. You could be happy with somebody that want to be with you. It's that simple. And then girls like comfort. Like if it's comfortable, he's not really bothering me, but it's whatever, they might stay. But are you happy with that? Are you happy with being with somebody that don't really care for you and they're just like, yeah, it's cool, but no like go get what you deserve go get somebody that's gonna fuck with you on that level you can do it oh, there's animals grabbing me all right that's it so let me know comment below and let's see i hope none of you is in that situation or if you are i hope this video is helping you and just get the fuck out kick her out like tell her you gotta go yeah you guys are too shy sometimes and I'm like, these girls likes you. I would go out with my friend and they would point at a girl and then they wouldn't go and talk to her. I was like, she likes you. And they'd be like, how do you know? How don't you know that she likes you? So today's video is about how to tell her girl likes you. You gotta know. Cause you're missing out on a bunch of girls for no reason. Cause they want you, they want you. She notices you and smile. So let's say you are at the bar and then you catch her looking at you and then she smiles ah! been attacked so again so you know you're like dancing and shit and then you turn and she's looking at you like this and then she smiles and then look away motherfucker what are you waiting for that's the the easiest sign to recognize yes she want to talk to you come go over there now